Oh, someone still wishes to speak to me. Um, oh, you want to talk, Will? Seems like a good moment to talk. Well, let's talk then, Will. A tingle runs through your head and down to your feet. Ah, there it is. That shiver. Our little brain worms have made fast friends, it would seem. How do you feel? Uh, surprisingly fine in spite of it all. Nervous, I don't like the, uh, the idea of that thing in my brain. Confident, no uh, tiny tadpole will, get, uh, will be getting the best of me. I'm more interested in how you feel. Uh, surprisingly fine. <laughs> Surprising is just the word, isn't it? Before the Elithid's unscheduled surgery, I'd felled hundreds of beasts and a fair <clears> few <throat> fiends. The tadpoles weakened me. Suppressed greater talents, but beyond that, I've showed no signs of turning. No nausea, no pain, not even a hot flash. Uh, something special about us, or at least uh, about our tadpoles. It makes no sense, I know. Why haven't we turned? Uh, we could probably dig up some poison mushrooms uh, if you're that keen to be sick. Um, something special about us or the tadpoles. Indeed. Perhaps the worm's that was poisoned. Perhaps we're uncommonly fit. Or perhaps the tadpoles are merely on holiday. We could conjecture all night. I suppose the why doesn't matter so much as the what next. And that answer is plain as the horns on a war devil's head. We get these things out. Let's get some rest. Dawn comes sooner than we think. Good idea. Um, anyone else want to talk? Anyone else have a um, like a uh, exclamation point on top of their heads? No one's over here. No one. Oh, you want to talk? Sure. You have an exclamation point. Everybody does. A fine evening, don't you think? The moonlight shines warmly on us. The breeze caresses our faces. Hideous. All of it. Would that I were doing battle up there, among the tears. Uh, what do you mean by the tears? Look above. Watch the moon cross the sky. The tears follow behind it. Rocky bodies tumbling through the sea of night. One of them is my crash. Clear. Uh, are all Githyanki from the tears? Your... Curiosity is to be commended. Githyanki are hatched in creches all throughout realm space. Clear is one of many. It's there I first saw a Kithrak mount a red dragon. Where I slit my cousin's throats at the Vaj's command. But enough of this. You are wasting your resting time. Come dawn, we resume our search for a crash. Okay, we will do that. But we will also bring home the, uh, the, you know, the guy you know, for the druid. I've been thinking, reflecting on what tomorrow might bring, when we find the druid. Will he know how to bring the worm under control? Will this little adventure of ours <clears throat> be over? Uh, it doesn't have to be. We can still travel together. Um, probably once the worm is gone, I'm going my own way. What, uh, will you miss me? Uh, let's go with that one, <laughs> that's fine. <laughs> Why not? You've been to the hells and back. Survived the crash. Survived everything that's followed. I'm not easily impressed by people, but you're stronger than I gave you credit for. Um... Uh, I thought you didn't like me. True, I'm pretty impressive. Just trying to survive like you. I have many talents. Uh, if you want to explore them, um, you're too close. I'm just trying to survive. Yes. We're more similar than I thought. Are you feeling all right? Hmm? Oh, um, I was leagues away. I just need to... Get some air. Clear my head. I'll see you later, I'm sure. Sleep tight. Okay, um, just a heads up. Um, I'm gonna play my uh, character here. 
you know, accurate to myself, which means asexual. So I'm not gonna be engaging in like that sort of thing. Um, even though I'm sure there's plenty of interesting character interactions to be had in that regard, but I want to play that character somewhat true to myself. So that's not something I'm planning on doing. <coughs> oh, sorry. Someone still wants to talk? Um, is it, uh, wait, where is she? No, didn't mean to uh, click those. Who still wants to talk? Do you, you're done talking? Mm, not here. Not here. Who wants to talk? Uh, let's see. You don't need any more conversations, right? Go ahead. I'm listening. Ah, not you. Okay. Let's keep walking. Try to find the last conversation to be had here. Not over here. Where is she? I, I assume it's... Um, what was it? Ah, there it is. There she is. There she is. Uh, right, Shadowheart. The leader of the pack comes to chat. What's on your mind? You must be pleased to have a clear path forward. The sooner we find the druid house in, the better. I can't wait to get rid of this thing in my head. Understandable. Uh, I always kind of mix her name up because, like, Hollow Knight is one of my favorite games of all time, and there's a, like, a charm in that game called the Void Heart, so my brain always scrambles the Shadow Heart, uh, scrambles Shadow Heart and Void Heart together, and it's... You know, that, that's why I always struggle with her name. Uh, except for, of course, my general struggle with people's names. Um, so what will come next for you once this is all over? Head to Baldur's Gate. Someone's waiting for me. Um, oh, who? Let a girl have some secrets. Was there anything else? Um, illithid wisdom? Nah, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna invade her thoughts. I'm sure there's some, some interesting stuff in there, but that's just rude. <laughs> uh, how are you feeling? The same. These parasites are proving suspiciously benign. But suppose I turn. What would you do? Um. Maybe I could leave you tied up while I hunted for a cure. No hesitations. I would just end your misery then and there. Let's not do this. I don't like hypothetical questions. Uh, if you turned into a monster, I'd run away. Um, one or two, like... I mean, if, if they completely turn, I don't think we can turn them back from, from Mind Flayers. If it's just starting to turn, then maybe the cure. But I don't think she would like to be tied up, right? She seems like she would also not hesitate and kill. Wise. So, I hope you'd miss me after I'm gone. I think I would if the positions were reversed. But you're right. If we're to make it through all this, there can be no room for hesitation. You're doing well. It's a beautiful night. I think I'll stay up to enjoy it while I still can. Rest well. Good night, and I think that's everybody now. I don't see who else we should be able, uh, we should talk to right now. So let's go to bed. Um, sure, you can auto select. That seems fine, and let's do a full rest. What is he doing? Everybody feeling better? Uh, very good. Anybody else want to talk now that it's the next day? No uh, exclamation points popping up. Alright then, let's uh, 
leave the camp and be on our way. Alright, it's loading. Have a little bit of water. And immediately immediately the loading is done, of course. Uh, now let's see, there's some like you know undiscovered road up ahead. Was that wait, was that something we could pick up? What's that? Dragon egg mushroom? I'll take that. Okay. That might just help doing full rest and stuff like that, if that's edible. I hope it is. I mean, if he can have a recipe for it, I'd assume it would be edible. Okay, and over here? Can we... Wonder if the gods are watching me. There we go. Um, there doesn't seem to be much here. Smashed cage, anything? Broken. Must have been here a while. Okay, so there doesn't seem to be anything in there. That's okay. Let's take a look at the map. Yeah, we've basically cleared out that area. I don't know if we can go there yet. There seems to be a cliff. Maybe that's what stopped us. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, we could check it out. We could also go down there to explore more. Or we could go up there and kind of continue on our quest. I might... You know what? I'm gonna go down here and I'm gonna try to explore this area a bit. There's some, uh, still some blacked out uh, spots on the map. And I don't really like to have those. I want to know what's going on. Oh yeah, mangled fisher, of course. There's too many of those lying around. Unpleasant, I think. But I guess what can you do? If a ship like, uh, like that crashes... That's going to take a lot of people out. Honestly, lucky it didn't crash in the uh, the grove. That would have been horrible. <laughs> like, I'm sure if any of the druids survived, they'd want some bloody revenge for that. Can we go up there? No? Doesn't look like it. Okay, so we... Is that even reachable? Might not be. Yeah, honestly, there's no path that really leads there, so I think that's actually fully explored. Might be. Maybe we can get some more exploration methods later that allow us to traverse that, but for now, I don't really see it. Let's go to the uh, roadside cliffs for now. I'll quickly check out this place over there, if we can go up there. <coughs> and if we can't, we'll go back to the grove and see what uh, what's there. Uh, in which directions we have to go to find, like, you know, the people we're going after. But first, let's see if if we can traverse that. If I just missed it, or if it really is at this point. Oh, twisting vines again. Nearly tripped. Good thing it didn't happen, but, you know. That's curious. Oh, dirt mound? Don't fancy getting my hands dirty. I need a shovel. Don't I need a... Don't, don't I have a shovel? Uh, let's take a look at the uh, inventory. Do I have one? I don't seem to have a shovel. But honestly, I'd just dig through it with my hands, if I'm being honest. I've got gloves on anyways. <sighs> Damn. Does nobody have a... Does nobody have a shovel? Wait a second. Uh... Maybe someone at camp has a shovel. That would be useful. Okay, we'll have to get a shovel somewhere else. I might edit around this part because it's kind of pointless. We'll see. Um, you can join me again, Gail. Please. Go ahead. I'm listening. Uh, join me, why don't you? With pleasure. Lead on. Okay. We move along. Now I'm gonna have to check, can you place like uh, custom markers on the map? Because I would like to come back here once I have a shovel. But like... Mm. No use digging with my bare hands. 
I, I would dig through it with my bare hands. I'm too curious about that now. Um, well, let's take a look at the map. Can we leave a marker here? Uh, location, custom, custom marker. Um, shovel. And uh, wait, where did I place it now? Oh, I don't need it here. Delete that. Put the custom marker here, call it a uh, shovel. We'll return once we have one. There we go. Um, so at least we remember that. And across oh, here. Way. Oh, there's a knotted roots. We can climb down here. So I'll do that before we move on uh, on the complete other side of the map. Because then the backtracking... Well, actually there's teleporting points, but still. The less backtracking we have to do, the better. Oh, a potion of healing and some gold. I'll take that, but skeletons, generally speaking, in my opinion, don't really bode that well. And there's a hatch. And it is locked. At least that one is marked down already, and we need a key for that. Uh... Anything else in the uh, vicinity here that we can click on? Doesn't look like it. So once... Dagger root? Okay. Ashes of dagger root. Um, wait. Where is that now? Um, is it in... Camp supplies? Supply pack? Can't use that right now. Okay, whatever. Um, alchemy pouch. Ah, there's the dagger root. There's the uh, dragon egg mushroom. Okay, we can make an elixir of uh, fire resistance. Oil of accuracy. And potion of feather falling. Oh, we have ingredients for that. I don't know if, uh, if we can quite make that entirely yet. Okay, but there's a hatch and I want to uh, find... A way in. Uh, one suspicion I have is that the key to that hatch might be under the uh, under the uh, pile of dirt. That would strike me as reasonable, but I guess we'll find out once we have a shovel. Uh, okay, let's see then. Uh, let's go to the map. And where's a better teleporting point? Okay, there's none in the grove itself. Let's go to the uh, Emerald Grove environs. Or are there any other locations I want to uh, scour? Doesn't look like anything's here. No, I think we've been somewhat thorough. Of course, in here, in the um, grove itself and the uh, Emerald Grove environs, there's some stuff to uh, look at still. And that's what I'm gonna do. And hopefully there's something good that we can find. Okay. Uh, now, where exactly do we go now? Well, let's go back up here. There was the battle. The time I tussled with hill giants without breaking a sweat. Now, a mere werebear could swat me halfway to arm. Strange things are happening to us. What festers in our minds may well impel our bodies. Ah, very good. They opened the gate for us. That's nice. Would be annoying if we had to uh, track around now. That would be unfortunate. Okay, so let's go across here for now. See if there's anything else over here. Oh, there's the um, elevator. Hello. Hello, Timber. Chit chit. Squirrel lunges at your foot and bites it. Uh, animal handling. I'm not going to kick the squirrel. So we need a 10. I have a plus 2. And that's just enough. That is just enough. You follow the squirrel's gaze to a pair of clumsy, ugly feet. Your own. 
on her territory. Looking around, her territory extends from one end of the grove to another. Uh, I'm not gonna kick her. Um, scold her with a click of your tongue? Sure. We again have plus two advantage. Let's hope for the best. Oh, that's bad. That is not enough. That's not gonna work. Inspiration? I don't know how, how valuable of a resource is that. How often do we get it back? I might, I might need that for something more important later. But given that my character is a bit naive at times, let's just do it. There we go. That's better. She studies you for a moment before twitching her ears. Compromise. After a final squeak of warning, break the rules and there will be trouble. She scurries away. There we go. Uh, reward. Um, what's that? A hyena ear. Alchem alchemical, alchemical ingredient. Combine three of these uh, to calcinate them into ashes. Okay. Accept that. Now let's take a look at the map again. Okay, there's like some stuff that's kind of grayed out. I don't know if we are going to be able to reach that properly. But I guess there's only one way to find out, is there? Can we go up? We can. Now is there anything of note over here? Oh, there's enemies up there. Commence battle. Okay. Uh, we have low ground. That's not good. Uh, we could... Um, what could we do? All targets within the uh, light turns visible. Um, flourish. Piercing shot. It's still just... Still just 50. Um, if we jump, maybe we can do something. And then, like, a piercing shot here. Or do we have. We don't have advantage. Okay. What else could we do? Um, sneak attack. We don't have advantage. So that's not going to be possible. Anything here? Color spray, blind creatures to uh, up to a combined um, 33 hit points. Okay, so we blinded you there. I cannot do that, we don't have enough actions, okay. That's a miss. Okay. You can, uh, what can we do with you? Uh, you are pretty far behind, all of us are. Um, maybe you can jump up here? Maybe that saves some... Mm, let's run here, maybe some ranged attack? Hamstring shot? Yeah, low ground is not going to be good, but we should try it anyways, right? Ah, oh, sadly a miss, okay. The blade will not bend. How much range do we have on that? Path is interrupted, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Jump over here. Um, not enough movement for that. Path is interrupted. We cannot jump again, but we could dash maybe. Here, two steps at a time. There we go. And now we don't have enough uh, stuff for another attack. Uh, that's fine though. We have to position us in a way that we can actually, you know, do something. We don't flee combat here. Tail for the ages. Um. We could, again, 
jump up here. I don't know, maybe that's... Oh, that was <laughs> suboptimal. Not exactly what I had in mind. Um, Firebolt. Let's try it. Okay, at least that uh, blinding thing allowed us to, um, you know, position our people better without much of a disadvantage. Uh, are you at a disadvantage now? Target is too close uh, for the arrows. Okay. Um, flourish, main hand attack, offhand attack. What could I do? What else could I do? Color spray would be blinding again. Um, Ray of sickness. Can we try that? Oh, that's a big disadvantage. Let's stop that. Um, disengage. So, so we don't, you know, get hit too much. Uh, now we are in a better position. Do we just... Too heavy to shove. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We could go for a um, flourish. We don't have enough for this. Not enough for this. Um, flourish. Critical miss. Now that's that's bad. Okay. Um, and that's it for our turn. Sadly, a bit of a nothing. <laughs> um, are we now in? Oh, you you are a warrior. Okay, so you want to be in uh, in range here. Can we like? Okay, pommel strike, bludgeon, lacerate, slashing damage, sweeping attacks, 1d8 piercing, uses superiority die, precise strike. We could lacerate, maybe? Ah, oh, a miss again. Damn. But we have, uh, we have enough for another attack. Um... Oh, your next weapon attack gets an attack bonus equal to your superiority die. Um, okay. We could use that and uh, use that for the next... For the next attack. That's fine. Uh, we live the next attack pretty certainly. Let's end the turn here. Favors the fearless. And... We can go here. Coming through. What do we have here? Eldritch Blast. Scorching Ray. Let's try. Oh. Um, projectiles? How many? Oh, how many projectiles we want? Um, I. There we go. A 9, a 3, and a miss. Could have been better. But we can also still go for a flourish. And it's off balance. You love to see it. Let's end the turn here. And given that it's off balance, maybe... Maybe it's easier to hit now? Yeah, we have an advantage. Do we, do we have an attack that needs an advantage? I don't see it, to be honest. So maybe we just go for a firebolt. Okay, another five. Very good, end of turn. My turn now. It has five health left. Ranged attack, uh, four to 11. We're most likely, oh, well that's not good. Um, that's not gonna be good if we have such a low chance of actually properly hitting it. Sneak attack, we're at a disadvantage so we can't use that, right? Oh, we can. There we go. That makes it easier. Alright, Bugbear Assassin, what do you have on you? A pot lid, a morning star, a basic poison and some gold. Let's take that. Let's hope we're not over encumbered yet. No, no, we can still we can still carry on. 